Welcome back. Today we are at the lab. Uh, lab X10. And we are gonna find out what's behind the door. Yeah. We are not really welcome here. Um, let's use some artifacts because it is not as radioactive right now. Be careful. From every side, there can be anyone. Get killed that one. What the fuck? Let's just be careful. Better take it slow. And not die, then take it fast and die. Exactly what I'm talking about. No, 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 no. Come on! <gasps> Let's heal. Artifacts are helping me. to hit someone. Finally! Oh! It is good to hit a shotgunner. Standing there, waiting for me. <gasps> Jesus. Hard time being here.
Go on. Don't be scared. Not easy fights around here. Let me heal. <laughs> Not me just trying to save on that kids. Bro! Why would you do that to me? Nine scene. What the hell is that? Fighting here. And they want. I love artifacts, just because they can heal you without using medkits. So, artifacts are of course more like rare and not often. So, <gasps> so up that much as medkits, but once you find them. It is better than it gets. You just wait a second and it will heal all of your wounds. <laughs> but sometimes you just need a medkit. To solve your issues. Эй ты! Ты не думай, ты от нас еще не ушел! All right. Do I need to change my suit or not? Let's see. Sure, impact. I don't know. Let's drop it. This is better. It will give us less weight. Oh. 
in the end, so. <laughs> I'm good. Okay, I got a bit scared, but we did it. It is just like you can see down there on like the red um, uh, part down there, like here, that it is slowly going up and also when the sign of like the blood is there, it slowly disappears, or when it's red and it slowly starts to t turn orange, then green, and it completely disappears. The those are the effects of artifacts. They just basically remove it. And I love that. I knew you were here, buddy. Exactly new. Let's take it for a while. No one? Okay. Thanks. I don't even need bandages anymore. Only med kits. And these. <laughs> Just like I have a lot, but. <laughs> Artifacts can heal me up, so. They got my back. Wait, I need to reload. See how it disappeared? I don't know. I just love using artifacts as my. Ooh. Healing method. If you don't give me a larger or bigger weight. No. Cannot carry it. Just want the bread for sure. If straight lock, uh, no, a marked one is hungry. We're not straight lock anymore. I wish we were. But... <gasps> Maybe we are. Oh, the hell knows. Nothing up here. Just a military suit. Does it? No. It doesn't give higher weight, so. Higher. Da -da 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 -da. And then, um, <laughs> when you take action, yeah. 
absolutely don't mind that someone just randomly rushed the boxes. No. So hard finding with them. Four more. more. And the yeah, I know down in the well. What? Yeah. <laughs> forward and not. Those are gonna be there. Shotgunner, okay. Okay. Ah, uh, had a hard time. Well, give me something. Into this one, please. Let's see. Many people shoot this up, but and yeah, you need to do this. It's just easier to knife it up. Yeah, mission failed. I see you have many questions for me. Then ask them, and then we can decide what to do with you. Okay, first of all, welcome, Mr. Trilla. I'm acting like I don't know this. I'm dumb. But here is the thing that is going to answer all of our questions. Who are we? Blah, blah, blah. Who is what is this all? Blah, blah. So who are you, first of all? We are the result of an experiment aimed at creating a super-consciousness called C-Consciousness. The consciousnesses of seven volunteers were connected during the experiment leading to the creation of the super-consciousness that is us. We immediately subordinated those who were conducting the experiment and assigned them to tasks we needed them to carry out. According to our calculations, Earth is surrounded by a special informational field the so-called Noosphere. 
It includes all the inhabitants of the planet with cognitive abilities. Our main goal was to make small adjustments to the atmosphere, allowing us to remove things like anger, cruelty, greed, and other negative factors from the planet. Individuals are unable to affect the noosphere, but see consciousness could. Unfortunately, we made a mistake, and our interference spawned the zone, which we have been trying to contain ever since. What is the zone, and how did it come about? What you see is the result of ill-considered intervention in the Earth's noosphere. Mm -hmm. Attempts to affect the noosphere brought about a local crack. The zone is simply the visible manifestation of this crack. The underlying problem is far greater than you can imagine. Um, what happened to me? You're a bolt that fell out of the machine. Unfortunately, that did not come to our attention for a long time. From the moment the zone was formed, many people have tried to get to its center, but we cannot let that happen. Humanity is not ready for the truth. That is why we recruited stalkers by promising them the fulfillment of their most coveted desires. Once recruited, they would be sent to protect the zone secret. Uh -huh. And what did it happen here? It was the best place. After the explosion in 1986, there were very few people left in this area, and we could work without fear of being found. Further, there were many powerful antennae here, which are extremely important for our cognitive optimization experiments. Uh huh. And is the explosion of 86 your, your work too? No, we had nothing to do with that. Most of us were only starting out in science back then. The Chernobyl zone was not used as a testing site for experiments until 1989. Uh-huh. Yeah. And what does the tattoo stalker mean? Or more S-T-I-L-K-E-R <laughs> Stalker is a coded acronym which we use to mark agents program for particular missions. Your mission as our agent was to kill Strelat and his group. They got too close to finding out things they shouldn't know. We created a network of psi fields in the way to the zone center in order to recruit agents. You know one of these fields by the name of Brain Scorcher. When a stalker attempts to reach the zone center in order to fulfill some wish, we acquire control over his consciousness and program him to a specific mission. A mistake was made, and your mission was to kill yourself. So here is the truth. We are Strilak, there was a mistake, and we got a uh, we get a quest, we get a mission to kill ourselves because of a mistake. Even though the mistake is quite big, you know, because suicide is a big thing. But anyway, what are death trucks? The transports we use to send our marked agents into the zone. They infiltrate the stalker community and carry out our orders without realizing it. Unfortunately, more than half of stalkers die during transportation. The zone is very unstable. You are one of our agents sent to kill Stalak. And we're now trying to work out how we made that mistake. Uh -huh. What? It depends on you. The zone is growing. We are trying to restrain its expansion. But humanity seems to be intent on hindering our work. Our resources are not limitless and the body connected to see consciousness eventually die. If you join us, we can restrict the zone's growth. If you decide otherwise, we cannot make a credible prognosis of the outcome. Listen, this may seem like you're gonna save the world with this, but 
this will lead to another bad ending, which means that they will connect you to that and you will eventually die. Which we are not going to do because it may seem good, but it is not. So I'm not going to help you with this deception. This would only just kill you, you know. And you can decide otherwise, fight your way in the nuclear power plant, and we're going to do that now. But since uh, our time is almost up, only four minutes, we will do nothing important. So this was all from today. We are currently here. And... Yeah, so this was all for now, probably the last episode maybe could be one hour, yeah, sounds crazy, because, um, because, I don't know, I don't know how would I name those two episodes, because they're basically would be the same, but I will see. Because I was thinking during this episode that we can make the last one the longest, which would be one hour. But I will see. So I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you aren't too surprised by the truth about uh, all this. And see you next time. Goodbye, stalkers.